For this install, both the plastic engine cover and front grille must be removed from the vehicle. There are two 10mm bolts holding the engine cover. Remove these using a 10mm socket. Lift off the engine cover, carefully prising it from its rubber mounts. To remove the grille, remove the six plastic press studs at the top of the grille. A trim removal tool is helpful for this. There are four clips at the side of the grille, which must be released using a flathead screwdriver. Reach inside and disconnect the lower clips by hand. You can then remove the grill from the vehicle. We can now easily access the rail and boost sensors. Unclip the factory rail connector by pressing down on its releasing tab. Connect the factory rail connector to the corresponding plug on the supplied wiring loom. Then connect our rail harness plug to the rail sensor. Route the boost side of the harness through towards the front grille. Disconnect the factory boost connector again by pressing down on its releasing tab. Connect the factory boost connector to the corresponding plug on the supplied wiring loom. Then connect our boost harness plug to the boost sensor. Secure the unit and tidy the wiring harness with the cable ties provided. Replace the engine cover and front grille and ensure all bolts and clips are securely in place. Finally, Ensure that the LEDs illuminate in accordance with the supplied instructions. Close doors, I'm a fool for your love.